and we go. So good morning, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Alan with Center Consoles Only. And the guys and I thought it'd be a good idea to start documenting our daily regimen and what we go through more or less uh, here at Center Consoles Only. There's some days that are busy and very interesting, lots of fun out on boats. Certain days are not quite so much. So we wanted to show you a little bit of what it takes to run center consoles only and to get the content that you guys like to see and bring you into our lives a little bit bear with me a little this is the first time i try any of this vlogging or whatever you'd like to call it with a camera stuck in my face all day and trying to document things through instagram as well as here so i hope you guys enjoy have fun with it let me know what you guys would like to see and we'll get a little deeper into that as well so here we go day one So for this first video, I kind of want to give you an intro to what center consoles only is. This was always a dream to get into, get involved in something that we enjoy uh, tremendously, which is boats and center consoles only specifically. How could we figure out a way to reach enough people that our opinion kind of mattered? You know, it's not that we are experts because we started this, we were definitely not. We're working our way to learning that. But what we do is try to learn something every single day. And when we try to learn that, we try to pass that along to you so you learn along with us. So this isn't a form of people talking nonsense. We try to provide facts so that each of you can become knowledgeable on the subject and speak intelligently when anyone asks you any questions on the boats that we personally come across and show you on Center Consoles Only. Living in Miami, you always encounter a little bit of this traffic. So today we're heading to the office since it's overcast, rainy. Doesn't look like we're gonna be doing any sort of sea trial running on, running around in any boat. So we're gonna kind of give you a look at what that is and, and what, we're, what we're trying to start there. So being from Miami, you can't go anywhere without a cup of seafood. So here we go, step one. Here we go, done deal. Now we're ready to start the day. So recently we decided to dive into a little bit of a project and rent ourselves a space, which you see right above me. Right there is center consoles only, first location. Kind of a big deal for us here. We brainstorm uh, new ideas. What can we do differently than everyone else? What can we come up with to kind of make a change? And that's where it all happens. So I'm gonna show you a little bit of what we have so far in the inside. Work in progress, so bear with us. All right, so here we go. Walking inside, you can see there's work being done here. We had to fix all this interior. We put a little engineered wood down. This would be a nice little office space to put a couple desks and computers, do some of our brokerage stuff. We'll get over here, we have some of our more technical equipment from uh, camera gear to GoPro stuff. We got that stabilization arm, some other trinkets. We go outside to the main area. You see we have some of our production stuff out here as well. Some of our projects we stick in here. We have a uh, 23C craft, still trying to decide what we're gonna do. We got a CNC machine right here just to do uh, any little projects we wanna do with that. And over this side, we have our CCO dock side. This is where we're gonna start showing off some products, discussing different things within the industry, and just get into a little bit more detail in that aspect. So as I mentioned, CCO is meant to be something completely different. We don't want to do anything that's been done before. We want to put our twist on it, make it our own. So that's why we're trying to create things like this, the CCO dock side where we can review products, show you things that go inside your center console, not just the center console itself. Everyone has different preferences. You do different types of fishing, different types of boating. So we want to show you the differences to see which one applies best to your situation. So that's the type of stuff that we want to get out to you through here, Instagram, YouTube, through our website, and wherever else we can. Get you that information that you need to make the right decisions when you're buying a center console or outfitting it with different products and electronics. 
So here's some of the not so fun parts that you don't often see through Instagram. I'm here with Brian Gonzalez, which is partner here at Center Consoles Only. He's the one responsible for our website. He's currently building one for streamlined boats at the moment. And we're gonna be doing uh, some new projects with Center Consoles Only upcoming soon. So just so you think, you guys that think that we're on the boat all the time, it's not always the case. There's a lot of the behind the scenes stuff that happens in here, which is not quite as glorious. So we just wanted to show you a bit of that as well. Something I have to go through real quick is obviously Instagram. This is where it all got started. This is where all our stuff goes. Besides this, we have YouTube. We do quite a bit of stuff there. And our website at centerconsolesonly.net. There's gonna be much more coming soon. So just to give you a trick of this, I have a repost app. And I usually have a couple of bullets in the chamber. Certain things I see, I come across them. This is a 30 foot Willis. I actually do a little bit of editing. I usually take away all the excess. I like to keep these clean. Center consoles only. Tack them up. Willis. And we let it fly. That's pretty much what it is. Do a lot of research. I like to find things that are not usually seen everywhere. If it's been posted all over town, I usually try to uh, not post that. And good to go. Well guys, that was day one. We had a few fires that we had to put out. Didn't put it all on video here, so I apologize if you didn't get a lot. It's more of a practice round for us. Actually coming up, we have a couple of sea trials. We have the Vandalized 305 that's over in Miami. Uh, next week we have Jupiter 34. So we have some interesting stuff coming along and we're gonna document all that and continue putting them up there as we can. So we hope you guys enjoy and we look forward to doing more of these. I will see you guys. You know, something really cool that I come across pretty often is the great people that we get to meet almost daily at Center Consoles Only. I mean, we try to shed light on amazing boat companies pretty often, um, but there's a lot of other things that come around with it. And um, here's one in particular. I got this box sent to my house. This is from Henry uh, over at CLE Cigars. Excellent company. And when you get something like this, I mean, you just can't help but appreciate it. Um, really cool shirt. And check this out. We sent over three boxes of some of the best cigars that you can get. So we are taken care of when we're out on the boat and I'd like to thank them very much. We're definitely gonna enjoy this out there with some of our friends, um, some of the CCO community that we get out there with. Um, extra, extra cool how these are personalized. Um, Thanks a lot, guys. And this is just something at the end of the day I wanted to throw in here. Um, wasn't expecting it, but definitely appreciated. So thanks, Henry, and the whole crew at CLE Cigars.